Hi Virgos, welcome to the channel. I am excited because I am getting ready to do your next sexual encounter and I'm doing them for all zodiac signs. So if you guys, after checking out this reading here, you would like to check out your other placements, then please do so. All right, let's go ahead and see. Give me the most important messages for the sign of Virgo. Who will be coming towards the sign of Virgo and why? All right, so your next sexual encounter is going to be, for some of you all, with an Aquarius, a Libra, or a Gemini. All right, you have the Knight of Swords here in the reverse. All right, this is somebody that they want to come in regardless of the consequences that it's going to bring. This is someone they don't really necessarily know what it is that they want from this connection. They just know that they want you. All right. You have. Yeah, they want you because they see you as the queen of pentacles. All right. Somebody that brings comfort, security, somebody they feel that is very beautiful, um, very handsome for some of you all. They find you attractive and this person literally falls at your feet. OK, you say jump. This person says how high they're like, I don't care. Whatever it is that you want, I'm here to be of service to you. OK. All right. With this seven of cups energy here, this person. Uh, could have other options, uh, but I feel like for them, they do a lot of daydreaming when it comes to you. This is somebody that thinks about every position that they can put you in. Uh, if you've been with this person in the past, they're thinking about you know how good it was, how soft it was, the taste, the touch, the smell. This is somebody that lives and breathes you. Okay. Whew, my goodness. All right. Also with that four of wands here. All right. This is someone... Um, not only do they have this sexual connection with you, but they want to celebrate with you. This person may end up inviting you somewhere. Or you could meet this person at a party. This is somebody that wants to celebrate. This is someone that wants to take you out. They want to show you off around their friends. It's something about you that brings out the fun side in them. Yeah, but there's that three of swords there in the reverse. So uh, there could have been a recovery period. Some of you all could have been... Um, this could, if for, the, for those of you that's dealing with somebody in your past, there could have been something that may have happened. Could be some third party interference that may have caused a situation to end. And you all could be recovering from this or choosing to move on. Let bygones be bygones. Or this could be where after a period of heartbreak, you're just wanting to have fun. You could be the one with this king of swords in the reverse energy there where... Um, you may have dealt with somebody that was manipulative. You've gotten out of that situation and now you're just looking to just kind of let your hair down basically. All right. You have the strength card there. Yeah. That's somebody that's having the strength to move forward, to walk away from what has happened. Um, and you're feeling very compassionate at this time. And I do, I keep getting the energy of somebody just wanting to have fun. There's that knight of wands there in the reverse. This could be a connection that happens on impulse. All right. Like I said, it could be meeting this person. I just got in my head. I'm seeing somebody at a gas station and just coming in to pump the gas. Like, oh, I just want to get, let me get 50 on pump three. And this person is like, I'll take care of that for you. And from there, <laughs> From there, they're going to put, they're going to take care of it from there in every way, shape or form. Okay. <laughs> I literally just started like a, like a feeling of like blushing. And I feel like this is what's going to happen. It's something about when you see this person, oh, there's a very strong sexual attraction. There's something about seeing this person could be a fire sign. I'm getting Leo, um, could be a Leo that you're meeting and instantly it's like, oh, I want you and I want you to. Whew. I don't care what you got going on. You and me in this moment is about to happen. Okay. Is what I'm feeling here. Yep. Things are going to be moving forward very quickly straight to that bedroom. Okay. <laughs> and it's going to be a very successful sexual encounter. This is someone that's going to, um, baby, this is somebody that is going to make some things happen, make some things shake in that bedroom. I feel like somebody's going to get put to sleep. Okay. <laughs> In a good way. This is look at look look at this woman. You see how she is like she's sleeping good as hell. 
because there may have been a period where there's been a long time, long time since some of you all have had any, like, you know, somebody to make you feel that way, or it's been a long time since you've had a sexual connection. And it's something about this person that just brings out the animal in you. Okay. Also here you have the judgment card in the reverse. Okay. Uh, and this could, some of you all could be doubting. I feel like some of you all are going to doubt that this person is going to reach out again because of how quickly this sexual connection happened but from what i'm seeing here with this six of swords it's like there's no need to worry there's a sense of leaving something behind leaving behind worry or worrying about what could happen next how could this end up it's just like enjoying the moment somebody needs to just relax and enjoy the moment with somebody and not always look for a happily ever after see there is that world card there in the reverse okay and a lot of this, I feel, has to do with a past connection. Some of y'all could have been dealing with somebody very manipulative in the past that you're still looking for closure from. But what you're being told is that this too shall pass. And I feel like whoever this person that you're meeting, they're going to help you to forget about what you've dealt with in the past. Okay? Why are these messages coming through for the sign of Virgo? Yeah. Why are these messages coming through for the sign of Virgo? Ooh, baby. Yeah, listen, some of y'all have been needing this. <laughs> this person is truly going to make y'all forget what it is that y'all had. Y'all going to be like, ex who? Manipulative person. What? You're not going to even, let me tell you, the obsession with this person or the way that this person is going to be obsessed with you, obsessed with your body, wanting to spend time with you, baby giving you orgasm after orgasm after orgasm. Listen, it's going to hit in more ways than one, baby. Let me tell you, there's more than one way to skin a cat. <laughs> I don't know why I just said that but just know that for some of you all it's literally you're going to feel liberated it, you're gonna start to realize that everything everything doesn't always end with are we gonna be together girlfriend and boyfriend are we gonna be married sometimes you just need your release okay now I'm not telling you to get out here and be reckless and you know do all of these things but I do feel like there is somebody that's been a little too stuck on somebody from their past and thinking that was the end all be all but at the end of the day you're going to end up meeting somebody else that's going to make you go I don't even <laughs> I can't even believe I entertained somebody else for so long when I didn't know this here was out there okay sometimes you need a little help moving forward <laughs> Sometimes you need a little motivation. This person is definitely going to be your motivation, baby. Mm, somebody going to be listening to Motivation by Kelly Rowland when it goes down, too. <laughs> go, go, go. <laughs> Look at that. I got us a room. I told you, this is going to be very spontaneous. Backwards cowgirl. Somebody's going to show somebody their skills. Woo. Making love. I just got Usher, too. We'll make love into the night. Oh, okay. For some of y'all, this connection could be with a Scorpio. Whew. Mm. For some of you all, this will be an old flame. Again, for some of you all, you could have been so focused, like I mentioned before, on this old flame that you all have, baby. This person finna take out to a whole nother level, okay? Whole nother level of ecstasy. All right, could be a younger man for some of you all. You could be the younger man in the equation. All right, could be a younger woman. Or you could be the younger woman in the equation. And you have here money and happiness, okay? Some of you all are realizing that right now your biggest focus, the thing that you have completed is the success in your life, okay? And this is the one thing that you were missing. Like you're putting in all this work, okay? Working hard, doing all these things, and now you just need to let your hair down and have a good time. So kudos to you. <laughs> you have, can I take a picture of your screw face? And, baby, there's going to be somebody mad. There's their ex. A bitter ex-boyfriend or spouse is going to be hating because they're wondering, why you're not chasing them anymore? Why are you not concerned? Why don't this person, you know, why don't you move to the beat of this person's drum anymore? It's like, baby, once you have gotten better... <laughs> 
you're like listen once i've had a taste of what's good i'm good on that all right so thank you so <laughs> let me get some final messages to close off the reading for you guys give me the most detailed and accurate messages for the sign of virgo most detailed and accurate messages please for the sign of virgo Okay, let's see what we got. You or your person could be of average height. You have payback, family, and friends. September could be a Virgo, could be a Libra coming towards you. Also, something significant could happen in the month of September. And of course, this is you all's energy as well. Somebody has the initial Q. Somebody could have daddy issues, okay? Wow, this new person, baby, the one that's going to knock you off your feet, they're letting you know that you are safe with me because this person in your past could have been a breadcrumber. That king of pentacles, I'm sorry, king of swords in the reverse, that very manipulative energy, this person could be the one with daddy issues, all right, and not the type to take home to mom, okay? So you all are starting to see this. The more you're dealing with somebody else, the more you're realizing what it is that um, it wasn't with this other person and why this cycle needed to end. All right, you have here short-term loan. Some of you all maybe recently got one, you're interested in getting one, or there's a family member. Yeah, there's somebody's getting a short-term loan from a family member, or they have gotten one from a family member or friend they're needing to pay back, okay? You have here oceans apart, okay? Could be at a distance from someone at this time, okay? Look for a new job while working on the one you hate, okay? This is important for someone. If you are somewhere you are not happy, look for something else, okay? You have here, someone has the initial N. You have here, what role did you play in this relationship? Really ask yourself that when it comes to this person in the past. And then you'll understand why this situation needed to end. Your final message, wow. Break the generational curse. Amazing. If you guys enjoyed this reading, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Again, I'm the Sag Moon Diva. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Check out my other channel, Celebrity Tarot Readings for all things celebrities. And guys, I'll see you all in my next one. Bye.